seen these ridiculous wheels that I put on the K10. Um, love them or hate them, I'm still not sure how I feel about them. This is the trend these days. Everybody puts these ridiculously large wheels with small mud tires stretched on them. Um, if you've seen some of my pictures on Instagram, a friend of mine has a, a F350 set up kind of like that. It's got a big lift just so it can turn because the tires stick out really, really far. I think they're, his are 22 by 14s, and it's all offset. <laughs> and his tires stick out a mile out of the side of the truck. He doesn't have his tires stretched, luckily, but uh, that is a thing that people do. So uh, I, I got a lot of questions about what these are and stuff like that, so I thought I'd do a little quick video here. These are 2.2s from a Tamiya Blackfoot 2 or something along those lines. The, I, I got them, they are plastic, they were really cheap, I think I got them for like $14 shipped. Um, yeah. <laughs> they, uh, they look like some of the American Force wheels that are out. There's a huge lip, and they're kind of directional spokes like that. Chrome is a bit flashy, but, yeah, whatever. I, I'm not sure I'm going to leave these on here, it's just for, for shits and grins right now. Um. I did stretch. These are one nine mud slingers, I believe, or mud thrashers. Oh, it says on the inside, but it's all stretched out. I think they're mud thrashers. Yeah, because they're the same as these one five fives. It's just the one nine version. These were the tires that came with the TF two short wheelbase kit. Um, <laughs> they're stretched all the way out. Those those wheels are just a hair shy of twice as wide as the tire. So, uh, yeah. Just do a little quick video. I, I did have one issue with these. I, I just sent an email to the seller on eBay. They are directional, and I got three that face one direction and one that faces the other. So my other side are mismatch, and this side they're actually going backwards. <laughs> Depending on whether you want to cut or chop, I guess. So uh, hopefully I can get that corrected and get some of the, at least one more, of the other direction so that I can at least all be the same. I can flip them around and make it work. But uh, I I want to say I've had some, some old Tamiya plastic wheels before like that. I think I got them with a kit a long time ago and they were like that. I got one the wrong direction. Whoever was doing packing on that doesn't have a very high attention to detail. <laughs> but, uh, let me show you some more angles on this ridiculous stuff. They don't stick out too terribly far. <laughs> the wheel does. The tire doesn't. Kind of see down the side there, and this is the look. I, I don't really know what the, the technical name is for it. I call it stance trucks because they all kind of squat in the back, and they got these ridiculous little tires on these ridiculously large wheels. And you got to have a giant lift just so you can turn in the front without all that offset hitting your fender or your bumper or your cab in some cases. <laughs> I don't know. I say part of, part of me kind of likes it, part of me kind of doesn't. I need to get a little bit more squat in the back if I leave these on here. I don't know why, but that's how they do it. Because <laughs> I guess you really only need the lift in the front just to clear the turning. It's pretty silly, but uh, I, I was really liking the uh, reversed 155 mudslingers on here. I thought about uh, painting the wheels, maybe running a different tire. We got another set of those, but I, I'm not sure yet. I, I'm Still tempted to build another TF2 right now with a blazer, so I'm not not sure yet what direction I'm going to go. But uh, yeah, let me show you another from the side so you can see the direction. Not sure how well that's coming out, and that chrome's kind of blingy. Yeah, this is the side I've got problems with the uh, wheels are flowing different directions. It's kind of frustrating, but uh, anyway, guys, I just thought I'd share with you. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. 
love it or hate it, I haven't decided yet. It, uh, it's different. <laughs> but anyway, stay tuned for more, guys. I'll see you in the next video.